2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Welcome to 2K Sports. We have the NBA coming up. Great to have you with us. Our broadcast team tonight, on one side, Greg Anthony. On the other side, Steve Smith. And on the sideline, David Aldridge. I'm Kevin Harlan. It's the 80s team taking on the San Antonio Spurs. It'll be the 80s team off the tip. Now the starting group for the visitors. Moses Malone out there with McHale. Then it's Johnson, then it's Bird, and it's Jordan in at the two guard. Now here's Bird. Back to Malone, and he converts the layup. And Malone, a high percentage score when he gets it in deep. Once he's got the defense on his back, the game becomes easy with his ability to score. Here's Parker. Pass to Bowen. Six on the shot clock. Duncan outside. It's Parker outside. Doesn't go that time. And the 80s team going the other way now. Outside Jordan. On the wing, Burke takes the three. Hits it from three-point range. Just such great consistency on that jump shot. Even though he's not always squared up, Burke terrific in the catch-and-shoot game. Now, here's Parker. Now the pass to Bowen. Fires the three. And it's Malone with the rebound. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the 80s team. Chalk up two there. Look, this is how you draw it up coming out of the locker room. Three of three so far. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively. For sure. No good, unable to end this run. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue missing. Oh, great ball movement there. Not a fast start here for the Spurs. Nothing yet up on the scoreboard for them. Pass to Muhammad. Spurs passing it around. Six to shoot. Ori passes to Parker. San Antonio again missing. Oh my God, they can't buy one. 0 for 4. Sometimes this happens. Duncan kicks to Parker. That one doesn't drop. Nice D from Bird. Yeah, slow start right now. Five straight misses to get this one going. McHale trying to free himself up. Malone's shot, good. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense timeout, and really timeout. scoring effectively from the paint. And San Antonio calls the first timeout of the game. Uh, let's see if Coach can get them back on the right track. Because right now it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. Duncan, the pass to Bowen. Parker against Johnson. Parker dishes to Muhammad. Here's Bowen. San Antonio again missing. Johnson with it. He's picked up by Parker. Johnson, the pass to Malone. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And Malone excels at putting himself in a great position, really on both ends. Just a dynamite rebounder and interior score. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And he makes the first. Oh. 
and both free throws good for Malone. When your bigs can make free throws, it's a huge advantage. Love his approach to get to the line. Parker passes to Bowen. Back to Parker. Passes it to Muhammad to end the run. No good on that one. And the 80s team going the other way now. Parker against Johnson from the high post. Tim Duncan grabs the miss. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. Launches it. There we go. Now in the scoring column with that make, he is one for four. First make of the day should finally give them a little confidence. For whatever reason, they came in a little tight tonight. That should loosen them up. Now here's Johnson. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Here is Ori. Releases. Connects. The jumper drops. Ori's got it back down to a single-digit deficit for the Spurs. Johnson surveying the floor. Pass to Bird. A rebound by the Spurs. Now Parker, he gets that one. Another thing that makes Tony a tough cover, you try to keep him from the rim, but the floater is really one of his best shots. Johnson kicks to Jordan. Back to Johnson. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Parker against Johnson. Parker inside. Banked in off the glass. Sneaking inside, converting the high percentage look. Something Parker does well. The pass to Jordan. And it's off from three-point range. And it's Parker with the ball, bringing it up for San Antonio. Six-point game. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And how about the determination of Bowen defensively? He's active and always efficient with that corner tray ball. San Antonio shooting their initial free throws of the game right here. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. The Spurs making a switch here. Ginobili's checked in. And so he hits both. And here is Johnson. Kicks it to Bird. Malone outside. Parker against Johnson. Just five on the clock. Here's Bird. Sinks that one from the post. Bird's got five points so far. Just reliable, guys. He's just always trying to make the right play. Duncan finds Parker. Back to Duncan. Ginobili the pass to Duncan. Some solid defense here from Malone. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Right side, Jordan. And here's Bird from the arc. Unable to get that one. Now San Antonio takes it the other way. You want your bigs playing B. Rips it down and track it. Here's Ginobili. And off the left side of the rim. And it swirls in for him. The veteran eyes see all. Frenchy with the tremendous look to make that play happen. Here's Johnson. 
Sweet little floater. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. Ginobili the pass to Orr. Here's Bowen. Duncan dishes to Parker. In the corner, it's Ginobili. Off target with his three. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. They get it back. Malone. The shot is good. And so is his shooting tonight. Three for four. Spurs trail by eight. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. And it boils down to the question. Toughness. One team showing it. The other allowing itself to be bullied. Gary's checked in for San Antonio. Here's Duncan. Again, the miss by the Spurs. Hard to create space in that mid-range area. He would have been better passing that off. Down low, Ginobili with the steal. That one falls, his second basket of the game. He's now two for three. He was able to simply lay it in over the top of the smaller man. And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. Uh, beyond the leaning, you could see his feet weren't set on that screen. Easy call. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. Ginobili the pass to Bowen. It's stolen by Elijah Wan. And here's the fast break. And they call the foul. So he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Playing with high energy, outworking the defense up the floor. And I just love it when the fast break results in a high percentage look. Not always the case these days. That's good from Irving. And guys, it's crazy. He, he really was a late bloomer. You know, Irving didn't have the big time amateur career you hear about with some stars. But boy, he's more than made up for it. Ginobili. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on Julius Irving. For San Antonio, they have gone two for two in the game at the line. Two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one falls for Ginobili. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And that's the norm for him. He's pretty much automatic when he's at the line. Pass to Malone. Elijah on kicks to Thomas. Ginobili with the steal. To the inside. Here's Parker. Elijah Wan with the block. Without a doubt, one of the most versatile shot blockers in the game. Elijah Wan does it in the painted area as well as along the perimeter. A uh, uh, team's rebounding is a great measure of its energy. And theirs has been terrific here in the first quarter. Here's Worthy following the score by Tony Parker. That's tipped. A second chance effort. And Elijah Wan finishes inside. And the 80s team leads by seven. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Passes it to Duncan. Ice ball movement by San Antonio. And how about the quick stare by Malone to get up and deter that shot, utilizing that size and reach for the rejection. A shot's good from Irving. Working in that mid-range area, the analytics may not love it, but that's a good look for him. Ginobili outside. 
Let's the three fly, and it's good in the assist by Parker. Nine points for Ginobili. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. That's a surprise. I mean, really out of character for him to miss when the defense is not right up on him. Parker against Thomas. Pass to Barry. Shot clock at six. Duncan misses. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Malone comes with the double team. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? The defensive awareness, the timing, when you have to face a defender that can reject you like that, it can alter your approach. And the 80s team has possession. And so Thomas will bring it up for the 80s team. Six-point lead. To the paint. Here's Malone, and he drops it in from the low post. Malone's got 10 points in the game. Defensively, they've had no answer for him this period, and he continues to stay aggressive. Here's Parker. Elijah Wan with the block, and they're able to recover. It took him a while, but he finally gets one to fall. 102 left to play in the first. Thomas passes to Worthy. Back to Thomas. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Parker against Thomas. A shot by Duncan. Nobody around. No good off the back of the rim. Hard to catch up when you can't hit shots. This is a quarter he liked to forget. Duncan with the block. And that's part of his game. Love seeing Duncan just sky up there to reject shots. Does a great job of utilizing that wingspan along with his timing. Now here's Duncan. Following the miss by Moses Malone. And Malone with the stuff. Yeah, we're seeing some fireworks from them already. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. That's a two from Parker. And the last second attempt doesn't fall. And so it's the visiting team with a 10-point lead. Some breathing room heading into the break. Their shooting has been the big key. Their percentage from the field so far has been terrific. Right back after this break. Welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And taking a look, guys, at the 80s team performance, what are your thoughts? You can see they were well-prepared defensively coming into this one. Yes, what they do, they take away the things that teams like to do offensively, also keeping them out of sync. Spurs trail by 10 on the court for the 80s team. Irving is out there with Thomas. Then it's Kareem. Then it's Malone. And it's Worthy in at the three spot. Count that one. Thomas with the ball. A pass to Worthy. Back to Thomas. Uncovered. Score the basket. His second of two attempts. Another good play. This is how they built the lead. Calling on the right guys at the right time. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Duncan finds Ginobili. Here's Muhammad. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. And those are the kind of nice inside looks they've gotten here in the first half. San Antonio shooting their fifth attempt at the line in the game.
One shot. Now, here is Irving. Malone outside. This one for three. But they'll get another chance. Thomas surveying the D. Nobody near Irving. That's good. It's Thomas picking up the assist. Irving's got eight. We're finding the weakness in the defense. That's the court savvy of Thomas at work. Parker drives in. Trying to break that ice cold streak. Here's Duncan. And terrific work on the offensive glass. And he picks up two. Six points for him. Hustle points count just like any others. That's a great play. Irving double team. Thomas passes to Abdul Jabbar. And the rebound goes to Duncan. Duncan's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. It's tipped. And that's out of bounds. San Antonio will retain possession. And he jumped out to that ball immediately. Great reaction on that deflection. A little bit late there, but you try to get into your opponent's head. Forced them to go somewhere else with the ball, and he did that. Warriors checked in for San Antonio. Here's Barry. No points in the game yet for him. Six to shoot. The Spurs need to get a shot off here. From deep three-point range, the rebound by Dantley. And then they continue to control the glass. It's Thomas outside. It's hauled in by Tony Parker. Parker's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Pass to Ori. And he uses the glass on the layup. Ori's got his second basket of the game. The staying power of Tony Parker when it comes to his ability to run an offense. It's Wilkins on the way. He's covered by Ginobili. High post try, and Parker with the block. Here's Barry. He kicks it to Parker. That shot misses. Worthy with the defensive effort. He's doing what he can to help them cut into this lead. His shot just isn't quite there tonight. Spurs trail by eight. Now Parker. He has six. Wide open look. That one wide left. Rare for him to get a wide open shot from mid-range and fail to connect. Wilkins, no good. And it's Parker with the ball, bringing it up for the Spurs. Inside, four, and the dunk by Ori. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. Here's Thomas, following the bucket by the Spurs. To the middle, here's Worthy. That one falls, coming off of Thomas's feet. And the 80s team leads by eight. In that tight, with that much of an advantage height-wise, there's just not a lot the defense can do. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. And just trying to get some traction offensively. Boy, it hasn't been pretty. You know, this is a good time to maybe switch up your strategy a little bit. You can't keep doing what you're doing and expect a different result. Now here's Parker. To the paint. That shot off. And the 80s team going the other way now. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Passes it to Johnson. That three off the mark. Spurs trail by eight. Ginobili the pass to Orr. Feeds it to Muhammad. It's stolen by McHale. Johnson outside. And here is McHale. 
He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. And it's Jordan. That time on the assist by Johnson. And now it's a 10-point 80s team lead. Jordan's gone three for five from the field. Parker with it. He's got six. And the wide open shot from Ginobili. Again, the miss by the Spurs. They've shared the load offensively. And guys, they put the defense on their heels. You can see right now they're trying to react. And that's what you want when you're in a rhythm offensively. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Ginobili against Jordan. And the way they have controlled the glass this game, really impressive. You know, you look at how they built this lead. It's been through extra possessions. Mm -hmm. And they're getting points. They're getting stops. And this is how they'd like to play all the time. Yes, when it's going good, it feels easy. These are the nights you relish, but they're tough to replicate. And the 80s team has possession. After the basket by San Antonio. Yeah, nice timing there on that catch and shoot. Jordan with such a musical rhythm to his game. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Parker against Johnson. Pass to Ginobili. And it's good in the assist by Parker. Parker's got six assists now in the game. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. San Antonio making a switch here. Bowen's checked in. The 80s team making a switch here. Jordan against Ginobili. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. And the 80s team leads by 14. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. Parker, and it's sent back by McHale. He's kind of lost his way this period, having a hard time getting anything to go down. Ginobili against Johnson. Ginobili attacking. He scores his fifth field goal. He's taken nine shots to get those five. And this team's struggles are not his fault. He's putting in work at the offensive end. Jordan against Ginobili. Jordan the pass to Johnson. From deep. Jordan can't get that one to fall. Spurs trail by 12. Here's Ginobili, and that's on a bounce. San Antonio will retain possession. Tim Duncan, he's checked in for Muhammad. Tim Duncan. Here's Parker, and good. That thing goes that time as it falls. Parker's got eight points. The defense late to react. A beautiful play we just saw. Bird outside. The pass to McHale. Back to Bird. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. He's given a great lift to this offense tonight. Very, very efficient. or so a player comes along who can be considered a true superstar folks that's Larry Bird now here's Ginobili he's got 14 they double team Ginobili Duncan the pass to Parker down to five on the shot clock Elijah Wan with the block and he recovers it and that one's good Parker and boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. 
now. Here's Jordan. He's got eight. Pass to Elijah Wan. Up top, Bird. Gets a very good look and converts. Bird's got ten points now just in this quarter. Building off a solid first quarter. He's been lights out here in the second. Pass to Bowen. That falls nice feed that time for Mano Ginobili. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. Parker against Johnson. And it's McHale penetrating. Over Ori. Elijah Wan trying to break free. Second shot opportunity. The shot will not fall. Duncan with some nice D. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single-digit lead. Duncan's got eight points. And Duncan just superb when he gets in close to the basket. Has a number of moves to choose from. And that soft, delicate touch near the rim. And stolen by Jordan. Here's Johnson. Banked in off the glass. He has six. And when you have this kind of size as a point guard, what a tremendous advantage. And Magic can really match up with all five positions. And a wide open look for Jordan. Hangs home the trifecta. And the 80s team leads by 14. Ginobili against Jordan. No good from Ginobili. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the 80s team. To the inside. Bird got a piece of it. And he gets it back. And you can see he just didn't get squared up with his feet. The 80s team making some changes. Irving comes in for Larry Bird. And Gervin subbed in for Jordan. San Antonio has possession. They trail by 14. Parker passes to Duncan. Rejected by McHale, but he recovers it. And the 80s team has possession. Inside. And Dr. J slams it in. And you love the quick ups, but then how about that explosiveness on the finish? Irving Man, he just has incredible gifts. Now oh, here's Parker. He's got 10. Ginobili, that's good. And they're hitting the long-range shots that they were missing in the first quarter, but still have ground to make up. Pass to Irving. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. That's exploiting the opposing defense in the paint here. That They've set up shop down in there this second quarter, and boy, are they cashing in. The 80s team making some changes. Abdul Jabbar's checked in for Elijah Wan, and Thomas subbed in for Johnson. Shooting one. That's it. And the Spurs with possession. It's a 16-point game. Parker against McHale. Ginobili outside. A three-pointer off the mark. The 80s team with the ball. 16-point lead, the largest margin in the game. Eight-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Abdul-Jabbar against Ori. Lock at six. The shot's good from Abdul-Jabbar. Exactly what they want right there. Continue to get good looks. Parker against Thomas. Down low. Duncan. That drops. And it comes off an assist from Parker. Parker's got nine assists in the game. Great passing. From deep. And the last second attempt does not go in for him. So as we conclude the first half, so far fairly one-sided. The 80s team leads by 16. And we'll be back right after halftime for the start of the third quarter. We'll see you in a bit.
And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. Here's Parker. Our second half of basketball and presented by Gatorade. Let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third. On the court right now for the Spurs, we've got Muhammad. Duncan is out there with Ori. Then it's Tony Parker. And it's Bowen in at the two spot. Two points. That one goes. Another bucket down low. They've been the aggressors taking the ball inside and attacking at the rim. Poked away. And the ball out of play. The 80s team will inbound. A fantastic mobile one block. This one deserves another look. And they're determined to add to the lead, not with more offense, but with big time D. Muhammad's gone two for six from the floor so far. And there's the pass to Johnson. McHale against Duncan. Pass to Jordan. To the inside. Five to shoot. Malone trying to break free. Johnson can't get it to go. Spurs trail by 18. That's a two from Parker. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Magic Johnson picks one up. Always looking for a way to create an opportunity. Parker catches the defender off balance. San Antonio shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. Taking two shots. Two. Two. The first one falls. Popovich has done a great job of developing Tony Parker's entire game, and you're seeing it right now at the free throw line. And Tony Parker drops them both. And with a little over a minute gone, the second half is underway. Passes to Bird. And the rebound goes to Duncan. Duncan's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Tries a three off the inbound. And, and not blessed with the greatest defensive tools, Bird uses terrific court sense to see the play before it develops. Yeah, good job to take it right at the D. For San Antonio, they have gone a perfect 7 of 7 from the line tonight. At the line for two. And the first one at the line is good. Yeah, the quiet intensity that Duncan brings, j just incredible. He's a consistent force whose teammates really look up to. And Duncan drops them both. So it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the 80s team. They led by as many as 18 points. 90 seconds now into the second half. McHale can't get it to go. Only one for four in this half. Sometimes it's execution. Sometimes the shot just don't go down. Duncan trying to break loose. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three-point possibility if he can convert the free throw. 
The Spurs have been exceptional shooting free throws tonight, going nine for nine. Johnson. Eight points for him. Outside Jordan. It's up a three. Rebound San Antonio. Muhammad's got his fourth rebound in this one. Very cold start to the second half. One for five. Looking for some continuity. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain momentum. What I like during this run, they paid incredible attention to the details at both ends. That needs to continue. Here's Parker, and it's good, two points. Parker's got 14 points for the game. Yeah, this offense is rolling. They've been assertive, but they're also playing on the Oh, Henry, get in! Oh. And with the monster finish, he stops an 11-0 run by San Antonio. Pass to Bowen. Malone comes with the double team, and stolen by Malone. And here comes the break. Here's Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. Yeah, Jordan just glides up the court. It's kind of deceptive. Doesn't look like he's running as fast as he really is. San Antonio calls timeout. We've seen Michael Jordan really having a great game. Good decision to regather. Talk it over. Your main concern now is how to slow this guy down on the offensive end. Checked in for the Spurs. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Johnson against Parker. Here's Bowen. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. Bowen's got 10 points in the game. And just no excuse, guys, for leaving a shooter like him open beyond the arc. What a defensive play. Gets the stop and does it without fouling. And Parker, here we go. Johnson with the clock. And Jordan has it in the corner. Johnson against Parker. Bird, the pass to Malone. And Malone gets double teamed. And when you can't get anything to fall, it definitely gets in your head. And his rhythm, it's been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots at the game right here. Shooting two. And the first one drops.
And both free throws good for Malone. Here are the Spurs with the ball. They're on a 14 to 6 run. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Edric Johnson picks one up. I'll tell you, for Parker's size, he has a lot of courage. Always a threat to get hammered inside. He's gone two for two at the line so far. That's good from Parker. And even though they're down, they are putting on a show at the free throw line. Dominique Wilkins, he's checked in for Jordan. And Parker drops them both. And here is Johnson. He's got eight. Outside Wilkins. Back to Johnson. Bantley the pass to Wilkins. Six on the shot clock. Malone. That's his sixth field goal today. And that makes him now six for 11. Man, just adding insult to injury. He just waltzes inside and extends this lead. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. And the pass to Bowen. And no good that time. Good D by Wilkins. To the paint. Here's Malone. And it's slammed in by Malone. And in terms of size, not your typical center. But, man, he plays as big as any of them thanks to that terrific leaping ability. Pass to Muhammad. Up and in on the layup. Muhammad's got five points now this quarter. One side of a great playmaker hitting his man in stride. Passes it to Wilkins. Over Bowen. Second chance shot. And Bird finishes inside. Bird's got 17. When, when you're trying to claw your way back into a game, you cannot allow second chance opportunities. Especially when you're this far down, you have to make the most of every sequence. Pass to Muhammad. The train. Out to Parker. Spurs passing it around. Malone with the block. Bird, the pass to Johnson. Here's Dantley. Here's Bird. The putback. It's good on the putback. And the 80s team leads by 14. Yeah, Malone is an absolute nightmare on the offensive glass. Does a great job of establishing that position for that putback slam. And the 80s team has possession. They led by as many as 18 points. Doesn't register as a block, but he did everything you want defending that shot. You know what he did? He timed it well and did a good job of contesting without committing the foul. High percentage look. This is what your offense is designed to do. Johnson with it. Eight points for him. Inside. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. And this will be his second and third shots at the line here. Larry Bird, two shots. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He throw good. Bird. The Spurs making a switch here. Ginobili's checked in. The 80s team also changing it up. Irving's checked in for Wilkins. And Isaiah Thomas is subbed in for Johnson.
And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line this half. Thomas against Parker. There's the pass to Muhammad. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have the jump ball. Pull, 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 pull. You two players. Back to the jump ball. And the 80s team has possession. Now, here is Irving. He's got 13. Pass to Dantley. From the arc. Rebound, San Antonio. We're going to have to make a pretty big comeback here. I think it's be a mistake to let the shot clock in under 10 seconds from here on out. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. And San Antonio has possession. Parker passes to Bowen. Parker against Thomas. Passes it to Muhammad. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. To the middle. And Bird with the basket on the assist from Julius Irving. Bird's got 21. Putting consistent pressure on this defense. Just the threat of him out there makes this offense work. Parker dishes to Ginobili. Knocks down the three ball. Defensively, you have to tighten up on him or suffer the consequences. Here's Thomas. Bird outside. And they wasted no time getting those three points back. Bird's got nine points now in just the second half. Now, Parker, he's got 16. Ginobili outside. Inside, here's Duncan, and Duncan throws it down. Yeah, and at 7-1, Duncan is a problem in the paint. Outstanding with his extension there, just hammering it home. Pass to Dantley, and it's out of bounds. Last touch by Thomas. No clue where that pass is going. That is a brutal turnover. Or he's checked in for Nazi Muhammad. The 80s team making a switch here. Spurs trail by 14. And here is Parker. Ginobili outside. No good on the triple. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. And that's just too deep. Uh, Elijah Wan with way too many moves in there. Almost automatic. And he'll be shooting his first free throw of the game here. The 80s team making a switch here. Jordan's checked in. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. And that one misses. A challenging stretch for San Antonio here. Parker with it. 16 points for him. It's Ginobili on the wing. Covered by Gervin. Just five on the clock. No good from Duncan. Irving against Parker. And then Irving slams it in. Yeah, and this is what happens when you have a scorer like Jordan on the floor. He attracts all that attention defensively, leaving guys wide open. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Oh. 
Free throw. Good Irving. Here's Parker. The pass to Duncan. Good D by Elijah Wan. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. And yes, it's good. Jordan's got six points in the quarter. And not much else you can do. I mean, defensively, you try to make it hard on Jordan without fouling, but he's just too dialed in. Here's Parker. The 19-footer is on the money. Parker's got 18 points in the game. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Irving. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. And you know, he's going to continue to bury those if that's how they're going to D him up. Parker with the bounce pass. That one drops for him. 18 points for him. He's doing what he can do to pull them closer, but it's not enough. He needs more help. It's Gervin on the wing. He's covered by Ginobili. Gervin against Ginobili. Stolen by Ginobili. Pass to Bowen. There's 42 seconds left here in the third quarter. And Duncan throws it down hard. Excellent on both ends of that play. Yeah, the steal was sharp, but the slam topped it off. Turning defense into offense. Every coach talks about it. Perfect example right there. And it's Durbin missing. And here's Duncan. He'll bring it up for the Spurs. They trail by 18. Ginobili the pass to Bowen. And stolen by Jordan. And here's the fast break. Jordan leading the way. And it goes down two points. Jordan's got eight points in the quarter. Parker against Gervin. From 12 feet out. Got a hand on it. They retain possession. And so it's the visiting team. Controlling the game and finishing the quarter with a 20-point lead. Their defense has been terrific in this game. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. Here now a chance to show you our assist of the game. And it's presented as always by State Farm. And I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, you also have the location of the pass. Puts it right where it needs to be, where his man can do something with it. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today. As we get going in quarter number four. On the court for the 80s team. We've got Jordan. Irving out there with Kevin McHale. Then it's Elijah Wan, and it's Irving at the point guard. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. That's a two from Parker off the left rim and out. And the 80s team has possession. They have a 22-point lead. It's the most they've led by. Here's McHale. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Irving against Parker. And McHale pulls it down. At some point when you recognize someone's this out of rhythm, you have to shift to something else. Irving passes to Jordan. To the paint, Elijah Wan. Great pass to set up the lay-in. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Passes it to Bowen. Here is Ori. He's guarded by McHale. Elijah Wan with the block. And that's out of bounds. San Antonio will retain possession. The 80s team making some changes. Worthy comes in for Michael Jordan. And it's Wilkins in for Irving. Oh, 
On defense, the 80s team. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong, allowing no baskets. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. Just two to shoot. Williams for three. That shot off the mark. And the 80s team going the other way now. Wilkins against Davis. It's Wilkins with the drive. And it's Wilkins finishing it off. And he just possesses that ability to wow the crowd every time he steps on the hardwood. They don't call him the human highlight for nothing. Pass to Davis. Here's Barron. Now the pass to Williams. Duncan against Elijah Wan. And Duncan gets double teamed. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. And the 80s team has possession. Here's Gervin. And that one is stuffed right through. They just won't miss. I mean, this is incredible. Good shooting can be contagious. You see the confidence running through this team right now. Bounce pass, Davis. Here. Their offense, Stone Cold. Another miss there. It's Wilkins with the drive. Elijah Wong. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Such a graceful player. Uh, Hakeem is, is light off the ground there for that rebound. And then the skill to send that one home. Here's Barry. Outside, Davis. Duncan right side. Shot clock at five. Down low. Here's Jones. It's deflected. Worthy against Williams. Worthy kicks to Wilkins. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Pass to Gervin. Pulls up. Rebound San Antonio. Barry's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. To the inside. It's stolen by Elijah Wan. Outside Wilkins. Gervin. Takes it off the glass. Gervin's got four this quarter. And not hard to see why they are giving up points on this run. Just too many good looks from in close. Outside, Davis. To the middle. Here's Duncan. And Duncan throws it down. Boy, that has to be a relief. Ending a 14-0 run by the 80s team. And the 80s team has possession. A great fourth quarter, just giving up two points. Passes it to McHale. Wilkins against Davis. Elijah Wan to Gervin. Worthy the pass to Elijah Wan. And that one's good, Gervin. Gervin's got nine points now in just the second half. Oh, good look there as well. And this is what Hakeem's worked on. Pay too much attention to him, and he'll burn you with a nice find. Duncan doesn't get it to drop for him. And the 80s team going the other way now. Oh, and there's the one-handed jam. Any chance you get, you want to put yourself in a position to succeed, and that's what he did there. Great job of reading the floor, got to the rim, and made a play. Williams passes to Duncan. Good D by Elijah Wan. And the 80s team has possession. Pass to Worthy. Back to Wilkins. And there's the pass to Elijah Wan. The three, kept alive, controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Now here's Davis. To the paint. It's deflected. Gervin with the steal. Inside. Here's Wilkins. A good finish at the rack off the slick feet. Boy, he is quick off his feet and, and really stronger 
than he looks. Wilkins can burn you in that painted area. Jones, the pass to Barry. And they get it. No good from Duncan. He had it rolling and then lost it for some reason. Let's see if he can get it back while it still matters. And every miss finds its way to his hands. Well, what an impressive performance. And we have to give him props. It's rare these days to see someone dominate the glass so single-handedly. Barry, the pass to Davis. Here's Duncan. And the basket is good. Duncan's got four points now in the quarter. Allowing any room to operate, you know he's going to be aggressive. Now Wilkins, outside worthy. Olajuwon inside, Duncan on him. Olajuwon can't hit. Jones looking for an opening. Here's Barry. The feed to Duncan. And the dunk by Duncan. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Jones against Gervin. McHale outside. He feeds it to Wilkins. Over Davis. And he overshot that one, missing. It's amazing. All night he's been out of sync on the offensive end, yet they continue to lead. Kicks it to Jones, down low. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Kevin McHale, that's his second personal foul. Shooting for San Antonio, Brent Berry. Taking two shots. Two shots. Relax on the first. The first free throw is good. Muhammad is checked in for the Spurs. So he makes both from the line. And here is Thomas. Pass to Dantley. Thomas with the ball. Abdul Jabbar in the post. Covered by Muhammad. Thomas gets a wide open look. A three pointer, no good. So frustrating when you can't get anything to go down as you're trying to help your team finish the job. Barry misses. The 80s team with the ball. They've given up just eight points in the fourth quarter. My goodness, he is such a great dunker. Greg, a high riser, no doubt about it. Davis with it. Passes it to Barry. Jacks up a three. It's Kareem Abdul-Jabbar with the rebound. And at a certain point, you just have to look to someone else to score for you. Wilkins has gone four of nine in field goal attempts. Outside, Williams. Outside, Davis. Pass to Muhammad. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. Four on the clock. Barry, the pass to Muhammad. Williams outside. That shot is off. And the 80s team going the other way now. And the pass to Dantley. Pass to Worthy. Shoots from the right block over Davis. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. One of the most feared, versatile scores at that forward position. Big game James always seems to make the most James out of any situation. At the line for two. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Oh. 
free throw drops for Worthy. And the Spurs with some changes. Brown comes in for Jones. And Smith subbed in for Barry. And both free throws good for Worthy. And so it's Smith with it. He'll bring it up for the San Antonio Spurs. Williams against Wilkins. Smith outside. Pocket six. Thomas with the steal. A minute 50 left here in the fourth quarter. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. Guys, we've seen a lot of turnovers in this one. Yeah, focus, focus, focus. Just make the simple play. Davis looking for an opening. Now here's Brown. He kicks to Williams. Just five to shoot. Back to Brown. Trying to end the drought. Wilkins grabs the miss. Passes to Dantley. But he stays with it. Oh, great job there. Tracking down the long rebound. And the clock will continue to run. Thomas passes to Worthy. Another shot. It's good. Right now, he's being too passive and not looking for his shot enough. He needs to be more aggressive and get more shots up because he's shooting well. Pass to Williams. Outside, Davis. The pass to Brown. Muhammad inside, working on Abdul Jabbar. Abdul Jabbar with the block. And beyond the obvious physical skills, Kareem just has a great understanding for the game. Times his move perfectly to get that shot. Here's Dantley. Now Worthy. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Inspired tonight. They fought hard and at crucial points just made the plays. Especially during this last run which ultimately put the game away. And here's Davis for three. Misses. And so it's the 80s team winning this one. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. Well, you know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports. So long and good night, everyone.